Welcome back, Finn fans, Finn family, to another episode of the House Husband Diaries. As always, I am your host, Carter C., and today we are keeping with the themes of, well, the directions and the uh, weather patterns. And so now we're looking at seasons, mentions of seasons. And uh, as always, as I'm as we're leading up, getting through March and April, uh, I'm I'm just gonna keep keep asking because uh, I'm really trying to get to that thousand subscribers. And I've had so many people subscribe; it's been great. I love it. Thank you. Love you all. Love your comments. Uh, I really enjoy interacting and building this community at the channel uh, with the House Husband Diaries. It's been a blast so far the last couple months, and just want to keep keep it going, keep continuing on. So. Um, as I said, my last video, my last Finn video, if I can get to a thousand subscribers by the end of May, maybe early June, I'll do a boots on the ground. I'll have, that'll force me to come up with a solve. Um, not that you can force it, but at least maybe, you know, we'll, uh, try to get in a vacation somewhere in the search States and, um, and, and, and put a boots on the ground. So, uh, not only, you know, like, but if you just take two seconds, if you're watching this, and you're enjoying, uh, you know, the, the content, then just hit the subscribe button and, uh, I really appreciate it. So you'll also know when, uh, Mike and I go live and Rodney and anybody else wants to come on uh, and then we'll have a good old grand old time, grand old Aubrey. So today talking about seasons and as I did in the last video, I think it worked a lot better to just go through, uh, numerically page numbers. So I'll be sp- just jump in between seasons. So, uh, I, I wrote them down on my notes, all the same, uh, you know, seasons, but I think it just makes more sense. It's just easier, less flipping and hopefully sounds better. So without further ado, seasons in the thrill of the chase. Page 42, right at the beginning, gypsy magic. In the spring, when the weather was warm, I used to raise the window that was at the side of my bed and put my pillow on the sill. Spring, warm, window. Mm -mm -mm. Katy Railroad tracks were about a half mile from our house, home, half mile, Half mile. A mile is 5,280 feet, right? So what is that? 2,640 feet? It's a little bit further than 200 or 500. Late at night, steam engines. I've heard people talk about steam coming from geysers as they're where warm water's hot or or water high. Uh, There's, you know, people talking about the railroads as their uh, water's high. Soothing sound. Mm. Comfortable, warm, soothing sound. All right. So that was spring. Gypsy magic. I know. I, I just think that's a, it's a great chapter. It's a great story. If there's nothing, if that has nothing to do with, with the chase and, and finding the treasure, at least it was an entertaining story and it, and it seems like it has something to do with it. Okay. Page 45. My dad had the summers off, being in the school business. So that meant for three months, I didn't have to worry about taking a test or having to please Miss Ford. I don't think there's anything there. He had the summers off. He's in the school business. But to mention, and of course, the other thing is he always spent his summers in Yellowstone. So when he talks about a time, it's always going to be the summer when he's in Yellowstone. It's not going to be the winter. He's in school as a kid. They spent the summers up there. So I kind of discount summer just for personal, just to let you guys know when, when, you know, as I'm doing this, I have my own personal thoughts and some of them I share. I mean, I try to share all of them, but you know, some, sometimes I don't, I don't think of something I forget. I'm doing something else. But, uh, I remember thinking that when I was putting together the notes for this video and, and it just hit me. So, you know, 
Take it for what it is. Page 47, the Totem Cafe caper. One summer, I found myself selling newspapers on the streets of West Yellowstone. So I think, you know, summer, summer. In West Yellowstone. Jellystone. Page 50. Down at the bottom. One summer, talking about Skippy, one summer when he was still a teenager, he disappeared into Idaho for a couple of days. I don't really think there's anything there. Page 55, The Long Ride Home. One fall, when it was time to go back to school, Skippy got an old Model B Ford and announced that he was going to drive it home to Temple. Is it time to go back to school in the fall? Or do you go back to school in late summer? I don't know what it was back then. Maybe it was the fall. After Labor Day or something. Is that considered the fall? It's probably getting a little in the weeds there. I don't know. Just trying to pick out every little thing, you know? Think, think something, think those thoughts that nobody else is thinking because whatever we're all thinking isn't the right thing. Okay, just a few more, another short video. Page 69. When my Yellowstone summers were over, I was a 19-year-old Lank without discipline, focus, or cause. You know, it's interesting that he says he was without discipline, focus, or cause. Because I think it takes discipline to get up at the crack of dawn and go be a fly guide, fly fishing guide, or just to go fly fishing. That takes a lot of discipline to get up at the crack of dawn, especially when you're a kid. And it seems like, I mean, I get that he didn't have focus for like maybe a job for life or something, but... All right, page 102. Do you think it's interesting that he, he talks about the seasons and the weather? I mean, the directions are, are less mm, surprising in some, in some sense if you're a mountain man or whatever, but... You know, what have you. All right, so, page 102, down towards the bottom. The grass sees and the trees and rushing waters of the Spring Creek also see. So, I don't know if he meant the Spring Creek because there's a spring below the surface of the water, or below the surface of the earth, and that's what, you know, it's like a, a spring that just comes up, or if he's talking about the spring runoff. But there wouldn't be runoff, right, in in Vietnam. Or is that a subtle hint to where the treasure chest is hidden? I don't know... I don't think. I don't know. You think there's just you think there's a spring creek there? A little creek? You know, paddle up your creek? You think that's the imagination part? Page 116. The top was covered with snow that I should have known would remain most of the summer. I mean, he's just talking about the top of Taos Mountain, right? I mean, it's just, it's high up there. It's high in altitude. It's cold. It's, it's going to be snow-capped. That's just pretty par for the course. I don't think there is anything there. More do not. But you might. You may. 
Last mention, page 121. June, July, and August in Yellowstone seemed to pass so fast when I was a kid that I often wondered if maybe summer somehow missed the turn there. And then again, I mean, he just talks about summers whenever he's talking about Yellowstone because that's the time that he went. And when you talk about your childhood, it just seems, you know, it's, it's pretty normal to say, hey, you know, in the summers I used to play you know, golf. In the summers, I used to ride my bike to the pool. In the summers, you know, as a kid, I used to do this. And then because you, as a child, your your life is it revolves around school year and summer. And I don't know many kids or any that enjoyed school more than summer. And so you're like, my summer's doing this. My summer, you know, off at camp. My summer, if I were writing a story a memoir and it was stories throughout my life. I think a lot of my, a lot of my stories when I was a child would come from my summers. And I would say, and, and you know, that summer when I was doing this, because that's just how you, you talk about it. As you get older, you don't necessarily say, Oh, well that summer, you're just kind of like on my vacation. I went here. And then it, it's not necessarily tied to summer. If you have kids, it, it probably is. But I still think as an adult, you don't really talk about summer as much. As, it's not the, the focus. So take that for what it's worth. I really, <clears throat> I'm not so sure that, that seasons have anything to do with it. But I thought I would just turn every stone over, leave no stone unturned, and just keep putting out some themes to see, you know, if it, if it jogs your, you know, sparks your imagination. Uh, those, those ideas, those things, themes, keywords haven't really struck a chord with me. Uh, like I said, I'll go back through once I'm done all with, with all these themes and keywords, and then I'll start to kind of whittle away, do a secondary run, see what's popular, the pages, the stories, and kind of go from there and see if we can't, systematically and logically progress through and maybe pare some of this stuff down. So this is just the first broad stroke of all the things that I see. And I'm just trying to get through them all, put the videos out every, you know, three, three times a week. And then, and then we'll, we'll just keep going and, and, and see, and then maybe something will come up and it'll, it'll be more pinpointed and more precise to say, Hey, you know, this mention of, of, direction or this mention of, of something ha, you know, is, is more specific and maybe does have some merit just in general right now. I'm not really seeing anything. If you are, let me know. Uh, you know, if you're, if you think it's, it's like the key to the solve, obviously uh, I don't expect you to share because nobody does, but, uh, you know, they're just, it's just fun. It's just themes, just ideas. And we're just trying to put them out there. In, in hopes that we can find this treasure this year, 2020, 10 year anniversary. We'll see if we can't do it. So thanks so much for watching again. Uh, if you liked, if you like the content, if, if you're enjoying, just hit the subscribe button down there. Uh, means a lot to me. It takes two seconds for you. Uh, really appreciate seeing that number go up and having interactions on the channel. So thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you tomorrow.